Hi folks, and welcome to Shake Happens. In today's Ohio Country Life vlog, talk a little bit about doing some property maintenance. It's getting close to dark here, so maybe in about an hour, hour and a half. I'm not gonna get anything done tonight. But behind me is one of my sorghum food plots that I put in earlier, oh, last spring. Most of it's laid down now. The deer have got all the heads mowed off. And what I'd like to do is get out here tomorrow with the Kubota and the brush hog and get all this mowed. There's a patch behind me and then over here there's three or four more patches and then I got another quarter acre on, an, on the other side of the property. And the ground's still frozen enough. It's not slick or greasy that I should be able to get out here and mow it. As a matter of fact, my neighbor did the same thing today. Just to get it cut up and give it a couple months to work in the ground so that when I come to plant this coming spring, it'll be a little bit easier. Today would have been a great day to get on this. Trust me, and I wanted to, but we ate up half the day, the wife and I, going to the local VA office for my six month follow-up appointment, lab work, filling out some more paperwork. And then we hit a few thrift stores on the way home, did a little bit of shopping, started some laundry, so the day was gone. So tomorrow morning I'm gonna get an early start, I think. Get the, got the tiller hooked up to the Kubota now, I'm gonna take that off, put the six foot brush hog on, and get going on this. And there might be a few other things that I can get done this weekend too, around the property. I do have some sections of TESOL on the property that I didn't get sprayed last year with 24D. I might get some of these mowed as well while I got everything hooked up because I don't think the sorghum's going to take too long to get mowed off. But I got to stay on these because they can they can be pretty invasive. And I don't want these on my property. We didn't get the rain that I thought we were going to get when I left this outside to wash it off. But here in a couple days it is supposed to get close to 50. So if I can get everything mowed that I want to get mowed while the ground's still nice and solid and get this Kubota back up here. I think I'll hose it down, wipe it down a little bit, get it back in the lean-to with a tarp on it. Schickster didn't touch it either. Maybe I ran over a shed, an antler or something, but that rock really clunked the blades. It didn't shear a pin or anything, but it gave me a little bit of a jolt. I'm getting 
getting the geese a little bit excited. This section of sorghum over here is real close to the pond. About half of it's open water. I'm hoping maybe tomorrow afternoon I can wet a line in there. See if I can catch some fish. This section over here, it's, there's a little bit of a slope that goes down. It's the last little bit of sorghum that I want to get mowed. But I walked around in there a little bit and it's, it's just a little bit too soupy for my taste. Even putting this in four wheel drive, I think I'm just gonna wait till tomorrow morning. It is warm right now, it's around 47 degrees and it's supposed to be up to 52 tomorrow. But it's supposed to get down to 25 tonight. So if I come out here first thing in the morning when that ground's nice and froze, I should be able to knock the rest of this out. Thanks for joining me here today on Shick Happens on this Ohio Country Life Vlog. I hope you enjoyed this video. I just didn't think it was necessary for me to film me mowing for another couple hours tomorrow. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, please like it, share it, and if you haven't already, please subscribe. That pair of geese is in the sorghum I just mowed. Wonder if they're looking for some leftover seed. A few months ago, I was talking about the deer, and the trees I plant, how they can wreak havoc on some. And this was one of the trees I pointed out. This poor white pine. Although it is kind of starting to look like a palm tree in Hawaii or Florida or something. Man, I gotta clean this place up. I got trash laying all over the place. <laughs>